First of all, he does not need Google. Now talk on a t-shirt Monday to Friday. Are we together? <laughs> I'm just messing with y'all. Welcome to today's vlog. Let's get to it. Back to my channel i hope you're doing well i'm about to start doing my hair today as promised let me tell you something vlogging outdoor is such a hassle like literally there's enough yeah that's what i'm trying to say as you already seen by now i was washing the hair by myself which was a bit hard because the last time i tried doing this like i told you in my other vlog uh was probably i don't know three years since i did my hair alone but here we are i'm not sure you saw the shampoo very well so i just want to show you it's a dew points shampoo uh hope it's focusing yeah what i love about this shampoo is that it is infused with the uh, oil and soap so the beauty is uh shampoos that have oil help to clean your hair while retaining the moisture there's this vlog I follow, she's called um, Essence of Shea. That's actually where I learned how to self-care for my dreads. Okay, I'm not like perfect, perfect, but I really got a lot of tips from her. So she said that when you use shampoo, like regular shampoo, it kind of rips your hair off of the moisture that it had. So the advice she gave was if you have regular shampoo, you can use either coconut oil, this one has tea tree oil so all these natural oils but i've tried coconut before so i can recommend coconut oil you can uh, mix coconut oil inside your shampoo or when you're applying it on your hand you put a bit of coconut oil and a bit of shampoo and then you use that to wash your hair reason being dreads kind of lose moisture very fast and not just dreads i think all hair it's a hair hack i learned from her and then coming to buy this shampoo i see it has oil i'm like oh my gosh this thing is real as in legit this is how things are done so in case you're still using regular shampoo please add some oil to it so that your hair doesn't dry up so much but anyway i'm not gonna be out here lying that i know so much about hair essence of shea she's amazing i actually need my locks to get to twice this like hers is twice this and it's healthier i'm not comparing with her it's just i happen to like her content and then coincidentally she has the exact hair length that i'm looking to have okay uh i just wanted to come out real quick and say that the routine i was talking about in my previous vlog which by the way uh if you're joining me for the very first time on this vlog Thank you so much for clicking on this video. I vlog about lifestyle, photography, and travel. So my previous vlog was about coming up with a routine 
uh, during this period that you're home it probably disoriented many of you guys and you're probably wondering how to get things done so you can actually check on the previous video then you come back to this for a quick catch up anyway so I managed to do uh, laundry and to declutter but my hair I don't know why I thought it would be such a simple task guys uh, to be honest I didn't do any of those activities I planned out on the day I planned to do them reason being the day I posted the video I was recording a bit of it that night so that means I edited it through the night a girl fell asleep editing <laughs> I woke up I still had so much to edit so basically I edited the video pretty much three quarter of the day so there's no way I could have started the routine uh, on that particular day but now I started yesterday which is Thursday today is Friday uh, as I'm recording this it is Friday the 24th today so I want to stop rambling and get to the hair I'm gonna guys I'm using a very tiny mirror here that if I show you <laughs> I'm not showing you. I'm not showing you. Uh, the mirror is to help me know that I am doing the right thing so that I can keep my eyes on you guys and at the same time look at my hair. Trying to make sure the mirror is steady. Wow. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna hold it up in a ponytail. I'm only told when I hold my hair up I have like a Kim baby face is it true <laughs> anyway uh, yeah so let's start this off I'm gonna use a um, this one of these to <sighs> curl all right should I like <sighs> I'm gonna look funny for the better part of the beginning of the video but just bear with me this is how people look in salon leave alone the instagram ones those ones are usually refined this this is how people look <laughs> i have tried to zoom in a bit so that you can see what i'm doing but i'm gonna start let start from the back honestly i've been starting from the back uh so this is the gel i'm using but i've discovered that there are others as well uh so probably when i finish this i'm gonna diversify and try others so you start with putting a bit of this uh i usually put it on my wrist and then i try and comb down on the roots like so not so much because you don't want to overdo it hair is very fragile you do that you make sure it's soaked in real there properly like so and then the next bit is twisting it's actually very easy guys it's very 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 easy okay so you twist it until you reach the very tip and then you can probably try and twist it some more to just give it a firm grip i've been using hairpins to hold them down but i forgot the beauty is the wax is very sticky so it kind of holds down um also very sorry if i don't look up so much you know i thought this was gonna be easy it actually used to take me an hour guys an hour and like maybe 20 minutes imagine so I don't know how long this is gonna take us but we go try we go try especially now that I'm doing it while vlogging don't we love challenging ourselves It has gotten so chilly I had to get a sweater real quick and the weather is actually looking very chilly I think it wants to drizzle 
a few moments later i think i have made a bit of progress uh let me just show you real quick yeah i think i'm doing pretty okay for someone who hasn't done this in years i am not doing so badly the buds are gray it's actually still raining uh, as you can see behind me i have never really utilized this space as much as i should i'm really appreciating it right now because to be honest the lighting in the house right now is very crazy it is not clear and i still don't have some lighting equipment for vlogging so to be honest i am totally like almost 98 percent relying on natural light anyway i am left with a very small section which i intend to finish very fast uh, I am not gonna style. I had mentioned earlier in my other vlog that I would probably try and look up a hairstyle, but eh, all the hassle I've gone through today, guys, <laughs> it is enough. I'm gonna get more hair products as the days go by because it's just good to have that self care at uh, the back of your mind. I'm even planning to now be carrying my own shampoo when I go for. Uh, salon appointments in fact most salons have variety so you'd find that they probably have the shampoo that you have but every shampoo or product affects how they will price you later and you know sometimes they don't want to chase you away because uh, of high prices on the service so they'll probably just use the regular shampoo but they know all that I think I think most salonists are they're okay with these products. They, they really know them. So let me just try to um, push this a bit faster because talking and twisting at the same time, yeah, it's not all that easy. It's not all that easy. So I'm just going to push this a bit more. I want to make the most of the natural lighting before it goes away. Done the joy in my heart right now, you guys. I can't believe I did this. I know I've put a, a lot of work in some, but you know what? I am genuinely impressed with what I've done. I cannot have noticed with these bats, you guys. The minute I start talking like this, they all just start in unison. <laughs> anyway, such is life. I am staring at myself at the mirror because. Yanni God made all that. Yanni, I can't believe. Oh, it looks so beautiful. <laughs> Don't I? Anyway, so I have like literally four strands left. I want to find out from my mom. I don't know if we have... I think I saw her with a blow dryer sometimes. So I don't know if it's her personal one or my auntie's. Let me try find out. I am done. This is it, y'all. This is it. Legit. Bana Easter. What do you think? Ninunulia is a right? Yeah, guys. It is now 7. It is completely dark. I called my mom. Turns out I was right. The blood dry is actually my auntie's. And it's in town. If I had known earlier, I'd have sent my brother to get it for me. So probably I'll get it tomorrow. But you see the beauty, my hair is not like super wet. So it won't be so uncomfortable through the night. I think I want to show you how it will look after that. Uh, so I'm going to end this part of the vlog right now because it's completely dark. But I kind of like how it looks. I feel like I'm reporting new somewhere. We'll catch up tomorrow and then I wrap up the vlog after drying up the hair.
guys i think we're done uh how do i look yeah <laughs> i was trying to make sure the white color doesn't um uh, doesn't show on the edges so that's why i needed to dry it up with a dryer but if you don't have that you can use a hot towel like i was saying earlier so now i think i just want to apply some oil right now i have tea tree oil yeah this is what i'm using right now i usually use um, mostly i use coconut oil i put it in a spray bottle and then I, I i have two spray bottles one for water and one for oil so i usually spray uh water on my hair first actually almost every day i also learned that from i think she oh she's called getty yeah uh, getty uh she also has very amazing content on um type 4c hair and generally just all kinds of african hair so she said that it's important to spray your hair especially if you're rocking natural hair spray your hair every single day with water and then you can spray the oil so what the oil does the oil helps to keep it moist and to retain the moisture so for now i don't have coconut oil and uh, my spray bottle is somewhere I'm not sure I carried it, I'll just check, but for now I'll just use my hand in the interest of time. done a simple push back because where are we going <laughs> I'm sorry I'm just messing with you we will go out there one day okay so just make sure you're keeping safe uh, sanitize as often as you can uh, stay indoors don't leave the house unless it's absolutely necessary uh, just do your part let's not give the doctors a lot of headache but ultimately God is our protection and we'll come out of this stronger that much i know as usual if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up uh it supports the channel thank you so much for clicking on this video uh please also you can comment down below i'd like to know your thoughts on this video or you can also uh suggest areas that you'd like me to touch on if i can uh don't ask me about quantum physics I left physics at like from two waves. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't. But it's not that I'm not bright. I am very brilliant. <laughs> okay, that's, that's that's really all I had for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm gonna see you on the next one. Bye.